ladies and gentlemen, this teacher that you're looking at molested girls for a decade. Now, let me tell you something. In many cases, they know about this stuff. They just stay silent. And whoever the higher ups are, they all need to be fired. Every last one of them, whether they knew or not, they should be fired. You know, because this entire school failed these children a whole decade. See, this is why you will never be viewed as good leaders. And it's just like jobs. Whenever someone's being racially harassed on a job, they all know. The supervisors and managers and direct, they all know what's going on. But as soon as lawyers come and people start suing, everybody go to playing dumb. Like they don't know nothing. Again, this is why these folks will never be viewed as good leaders, because they're not. So the school just completely failed the, these girls that got molested by this woman. Veteran Florida teacher skipped class to molest her students, cops. A 20-year veteran teacher at Hialeah High School, just outside of Miami, has been arrested for sexually abusing underage students for more than a decade. That is just sick. Jeanette Valley Tejeda, she was 41 years old and was booked on Friday on a series of charges, including sexual battery, child abuse, and lewd assault on a child under the age of 16. As NBC Miami reported, one victim told the school officials and the police that Valley to Jetta began molesting her in 2009 when she was just 14 years old, middle school student. Arrest documents viewed by local news outlets said Valley to Jetta groomed the students and gave her financial assistance. She slept over the teacher's house often. The document said the abuse lasted for years until the student turned 18, according to a CBS affiliate. Valley Tejeda allegedly skipped school with the girl and pulled her out of other classes without her mom's permission. Mm -mm -mm. The two would go to the beach or restaurants and took showers together. The report says that Valley Tejeda uh, acted as a mother figure. Two more victims have reportedly come forward to police, including one who said she was 11 when Valley Tejeda began to romantically, um, so she was romantic with this 11-year-old. Girl, you got a problem. Seven News Miami reports, one former student said she would engage in sexual acts on school grounds. Valley Tejeda also encouraged her to participate in phone sex, but constantly reminded the victim to erase incriminating sex. <laughs> so uh, sex messages, you know, the uh, sex, I guess that's what they call it. Wow, she did that with an 11-year-old, y'all. An 11-year-old phone sex with an 11-year-old. Mm, mm, mm. Another victim alleged that Valley Tejeda took her to clubs and bars when she was 17. Valley Tejeda was arrested and taken to Turner Guilford Knight Correctional Center. She is being held without bond on a slew of charges and was fired from her reading teacher position. Yeah, after doing it for over 10 years, they finally got around to firing her. Uh-uh-uh. Halia... Um, so the high school also scrubbed her from the website. So they must have had teacher pictures on the website of the school and they took her off. Miami-Dade School District released a statement. Miami-Dade County Public Schools is deeply disturbed by the allegations made against this individual. As soon as the claim surfaced last month, the employee was removed from the school setting and Miami-Dade school police launched an investigation. The district will be terminating her employment 
and she will be prevented from seeking future work with the school system. Yeah, but as long as she's got a teaching license, ladies and gentlemen, she can go somewhere else and teach. You know, it's not like they revoked anything from her. They didn't, not according to this story. It's just like cops. You know, they kill someone unarmed. They just go to another county and work as a police officer again. And it shouldn't be this way. You know, once you touch a child or do inappropriate things to children and you're a teacher, you should never be able to teach again. You know, she's 41 years old. Even if they put her in jail for five years, she can move somewhere else in the country and get another teaching job. <sighs> you know, these kind of people always seem to end up around children. It never fails. You know, who do the screening for these folks being hired? You know, it's amazing how many of them can slip through the crack. It's not a month that goes by that we don't hear about a teacher sleeping with a student in America. It's a disgrace. This is embarrassing. And no wonder why so many parents are not sending their children back to school. You know, it's bad enough they're dealing with COVID, but you got to worry about these creeps like this woman. Y'all, please tell me what you think. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.